don't care. The president called. Barack, oh, what's up, man? How you doing? Hey, tell you what, got Mr. Cooper in the chair. I'll get back to you, Barack. Yeah, okay. All right. Bye-bye. <laughs> Barack ain't praying this, for this haircut right now. Do you understand me? If you do that every day to every customer, man, you are... I'm trying to tell you, you be so busy, you don't know what to do. They will find you. They will hear about, the dude, the customer service is off the chain. You calling him in the morning and reminding him? When, he, when, when have you ever heard of a barber? When? when? In your shop, do, do barbers call their customers and remind them about their, customer, their, their appointment in the morning? You come in the morning at, at work in the morning, nine o'clock in the morning, and you start right in calling your customers. Hey, Joe, what's up? Zion, uh, yeah. I'm just calling looking for me, eleven o'clock. Good, cool. Okay. All right, see you then. <coughs> yeah, Paul. Okay, yeah, twelve o'clock. All right. You still coming? Cool. All right. Now how am I doing that? Because when Joe got the chair two weeks ago, or last week, I made the appointment for the day. In the book. I know what I'm going to do today. I ain't going in there blind, hoping and praying that somebody walk in. Please, Jesus, send me somebody. <laughs> send me some customers. Come on, Doc. You're in business. You in there having a prayer line trying to get a customer. You need, you need to make up your mind that you want success. You got to make it happen. 